everyone, my name is Miss Tui. In today's lesson, we are going to have a bit of fun with our Ozobot and division. For today's lesson, you will need an Ozobot fully charged and calibrated, your color code markers, a pencil, your division maze activity sheets, make sure to have all three pages, and white stickers to correct any mistakes. If you don't have the Ozobot stickers, you can use plain white stickers or just redraw your maze on a separate sheet of paper if you make a mistake. Your goal will be to correctly solve math division facts for problems with divisors one through 10. Then you will use your answers to get your Ozobot through the mazes to the finish where your Ozobot will do a victory dance. Put on your math cap and let's get started. Find division maze activity, page one. Let's go through the first two division facts to get you started. You will be finding the quotient. A quotient is the answer you get when you divide one number by another. On division maze one, the first problem you see is 40 divided by five. What is 40 divided by five? That's correct, it is eight. Write the number eight on the line provided for your quotient. If you continue along the maze, the second division fact you come to is six divided by three. What is six divided by three? Write again, it's two. Write two on the line. Can you fill in the quotients for your division problems for your maze? Make sure to get every single one filled in. Now that you've gotten the division facts completed, let's fill in the color codes on your maze. In the first example, 40 divided by five, the quotient was eight. Find the number eight in the key. Remember, this is division activity maze one, so we'll be using that key. The color code for eight is blue, black, green, and red. Be sure that you are filling in the code in the direction your bot will travel, so the top box will be blue. The next box will be black, and then green, and then red at the bottom. It's important that the Ozobot reads the color in that order. This is called an asymmetrical code because it is not read the same way forwards and backwards. Can you find and fill in the color code for 40 divided by five equals eight? Let's take a look at our next problem. 6 divided by 3 equals 2, and we can find 2 in our answer key. The code for 2 is red, black, red. This is a symmetrical color code because the bot will read it the same way, forwards and backwards. As you're filling in the color codes for the rest of the division facts, some of the codes have an arrow to show which direction the bot will be traveling when reading the code. Be sure to fill in the colors in the correct direction because these are asymmetrical codes. Can you fill in the rest of the color codes using the key? Your color codes are all done, and now you're ready to see if the bot can get to the victory dance at the end of the maze. Turn your bot on and place it on start. Can you identify the codes by what the Ozobot does as it passes over each code? Nice work. Can your bot get to the end of the maze and do the victory dance?
Once you're finished with maze one, move on to division maze activity two. Fill in the quotients for the division problems. Then compare your quotients to the answer key and fill in the color codes on your maze. Once your codes are filled in, turn on your Ozobot and see if it can get to the victory dance at the finish. Nice work finishing all those division problems and color codes. Did your bot do a victory dance at the end? Let's double check that your work is complete. Have you completed all the division problems on both mazes? Have you filled in the correct color codes? And did your Ozobot do a victory dance when it reached the finish for each maze? Come back again soon for our next lesson.